Wow wow wow. Dear friends. I'm surprised, honestly. If you're already in the game, you already know that there is a new dev vlog release. Hey guys. Well and that's exactly what we're going to discuss with you now in more detail. And so, the first thing I want to note for you is that in the video there was not a word about FFA mode. Although in many of the previous releases of it talked about it all the time. And now there are two options, either it will be very soon. Or the developers are waiting for something to release this mode in conjunction with some new features. That is, it was not just another mode like 2v2 in which only a few people play. But with some additional motivation. Time will tell. Next. Aegis. Judging by Freya's talk, we can understand that this is not the final version of Aegis and it's quite possible it can be improved if necessary. Just like they did with Stalker. If you think that's something he lacks, write about it. Next is the new mech called Loki. And as fits his name, the ability of this mech will be related to tricking. This is an epic support mech. Most likely 24 energy at maximum. My opinion is to trick the enemy detection systems. That is, they see you as an ally, which will allow you to come to their rear and kill someone in the back. And without proper communication between players this will be a huge problem. But there's no detailed information yet, so write your assumptions on what ability he will have. Next is a weapon that we have already seen before. And we already know its name. It's a gravity beam. There will be three versions, at 10, 12 and 16 energies. It builds up a charge over the enemy's head, and when it fills up completely, it will do significant damage. This will be the first legendary weapon of the beam category. It is not easy to define its stats yet, but very likely it will be good for tough mechs who can accumulate a charge to explode before they will be killed. Theoretically it looks very interesting, but in practice I'm afraid that this weapon won't be in high demand. Time will tell. Next. Two new pilots. Lotus the pilot from India and Oksana the pilot from Ukraine. If you are interested in the details of the lore of these two pilots, you can see in the original video. But you are probably more interested in what kind of pilots they are. And most likely they will be legendary pilots with the type, guided and close quarters. Why them? Because we already know that the sniper is Archangel. Also a legendary pilot helmet who specializes in missiles. So that leaves us with three unknowns. Artillery, guided, close quarters. And I am absolutely sure that the legendary artillery pilot we will not see for a very long time. And finally, new maps. I am sure that all of you, who have been playing Mech Arena for a long time, bored with the same maps in the tournament. So soon there will be an addition to this list. Three new maps will be added to the tournament map rotation. And as there will be a new one for CPC mode, well, in general, it was voiced what we all have been waiting for a long time are ways to get new things. As they said before, in progress path more nothing new will be added. But now there an active work on the new functionality, which will allow you to get new items from there. No details are available yet, but the result will be soon. Most likely this summer we will see it. Also soon will be clans, so get ready. If you liked my analysis and comments, definitely like and subscribe to me. And if you want to support me, I will be infinitely grateful to you. That's all. Thank you for your attention and see you in the next video.